Okay. When I left that Geneva Convention message, I was stumbling all over myself, and I want to clarify a few things. Uh, the reason I started stumbling on myself is because I couldn't think of a good reason why they shouldn't clarify it, the Geneva Convention. Bush wants to clarify it, so he, know, so, so he can tell the people, so everyone will know what we can do and what we can't do. It will specifically lay out what we cannot do and then it will specifically say what we can do. However, I take issue with that because I don't think that it can lay out enough things. There's going to be a loophole eventually. Secondly, even if you did lay everything out, and let's see, you, you figured out a way to say it's okay to call them, to call them names. Okay? Name calling, it's not that bad, right? It doesn't seem that bad one time. What about that the second day? And then the second week? And then the second month, and then the year, and then the second year that the prison has been there. Every day, calling them names and making them feel terrible. Not just name, I mean, name calling of all sorts. It's no holds barred. You can eff effectively say anything you want to them. Now that's jacked up, because that is straight up psychological torture. Could you imagine being in prison? But not just in prison where you have to sit, in prison where you're, you're called and told awful things about yourself every day. It's torture. You know, you're not, putting, you're not putting needles under their fingernails, but it's torture. There's a reason why Article 3, Section C states, outrages upon personal dignity, in particular, humiliating and degrading treatment. Now, if he's not torturing them, I have no idea what he's doing that's so effective. If he's not degrading them or humiliating them, I have no idea what he's doing. I can't imagine that he's not. He's getting into trouble because apparently he was violating it. I assume he was humiliating them or degrading them. Doesn't seem as bad because it's not physical, but it's bad. It's really, really bad. And the Geneva Convention is written like this for a reason. They weren't stupid 50 years ago. They knew what they were doing. This has never come up before. There's a reason for it. Leave it alone. Now, hopefully, that clarification will work.